What's up to all of my beautiful and my handsome collective out there? So, you guys, this is going to be your horoscope for March the 27th through March the 29th, okay? So, if anything resonates for you, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment so that you will receive more of these horoscopes so you will receive a notification every time that I upload, okay? If you are interested in a personal, I am running a special on my readings right now, and all the information you need will be in the description box below so let's go on and get into this horoscope for march the 27th through the 29th okay so some of you in my collective will have a reason to celebrate okay this gives me the energy like four of wands okay there could be some joy there could be happiness fun here so this could be some of you could be receiving some type of good news it's going to be like you've been waiting for some type of news or something to come in and this is going to be your reason to celebrate okay there can be some type of fun energy or enjoyment maybe you're going out having some fun all right you guys you are guaranteed success march the 27th through the 29th so whatever you put your hands on whatever you're working hard at you are guaranteed success okay so something could be aspecting possibly in your 10th house it just has to do with you know with work and career but we got the sun so far you guys these are awesome cards okay we got the sun this house about happiness and well-being so if there has been a period that you haven't felt so happy you know you haven't been sure about things in your life but this is going to be a few days where you're going to be feeling very happy very safe and secure your well-being like you feel like everything is going to be all right and for some of you someone new is about to be entering your life march the 27th through the 29th okay i think a collective reading i did a couple of weeks ago talk about secret uh my secret admirer or compliments from an admirer okay so some of you can have this chair empty you know you've been single for a while okay and that chair is about to be filled yeah is about to be filled because someone new is about to enter your life okay but for some of you you could be seeing five 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 this can be your angels confirming this information okay but when this new person enters your life collective there's going to be someone around you that's going to view this new person as competition okay they're going to look at this new person as a rivalry and there's going to be some type of conflict okay you and this person can have some type of disagreement okay so someone from your past you can be having a disagreement with this person because they're very territorial over you okay they don't want you to be dealing with nobody else some of you guys have been for a long time okay and somebody from your past they're not gonna like the fact that you're dealing with someone new okay because that gives them the idea that you have moved on from them you ain't interested you ain't effed up about them okay and this could cause some type of misunderstanding between you and somebody else okay or there could be an energy of you and someone having a misunderstanding so when i clarify this you guys we got the page of swords in reverse okay this misunderstanding could come around some type of gossip or bad information, okay? So you and someone could have a misunderstanding because maybe there was some gossip or bad information that was given. All right, you could be dealing with someone who's very devious. They're trying to manipulate you in some type of way. For some of you, there can be a misunderstanding between you and someone who's trying to avoid you or there's been a stalemate. Or this is someone who's not thinking before they make some type of decision. So this could be someone that could say something to you, you know what I'm saying? But this could cause for some type of disagreement here. All right, then we got Rooster. So we got an arrogant, boastful person that you should not cross. So some of you guys are being warned that you got this arrogant, boastful person in your energy and you shouldn't cross this person okay this is someone that their confidence has been destroyed by something or they, or they can be overwhelmed by some things some responsibilities that's going on in their life they doubt themselves and they lack confidence okay but they're still arrogant as fuck okay so you are being warned not to cross this 
Eric and Bert person, okay? And someone in your energy could be very independable or insincere. This means they don't take your feelings into accountability or this is someone who you can't depend on. So March the 27th through the 29th, there can be, you know, maybe you're dependent on someone to come through or do something for you. And it's like this person really doesn't care about your feelings, you know, or they may act like, you know, there can be a, something that's said and it makes you feel like this person kind of is insensitive to your needs or what you're going through. All right, some of you, there could be some hard work ahead, okay? Because you're guaranteed success in something. So this could be some type of offer. This could be maybe with a job or maybe someone's going to present you an opportunity to do something. And you're guaranteed success with this, but this could also bring in some hard work here, okay? And you could be given some type of good advice from a wise person, okay? This could be someone older. This could be a family member, a friend. You could be seeking some type of advice. You know, maybe you got a conflict or something going on between maybe you and this person. You had a misunderstanding. But you can be getting some good advice from a wise person, all right? So the signs that could be significant for you guys, this could be your sign or someone that you're dealing with, okay? We had heavy Leo energy. We also had Libra. And we got Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So some of you could be dealing with the air sign, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, a Libra in particular. And we also got heavy Leo energy. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.